here they are. The brave ones that have made it to the end. All of them. Powerful units. And my boy Geats. Alright. So. Let's get started. I don't know how I want to start approaching this. Ah. Uh, well, you do have the Delphi shield. I could... Yeah, that's... I need to get that the hell out of here. Um, as stated before, all morphs had no luck. At all. So, our boy Legault is capable of dealing with them with a little bit of luck, yes. But he is more than capable of dealing with them. So, come on, silencer. Yup, Legault actually has a lot of quotes with a lot of them. Alright, so he did not get the good crit. Mm. Might be a little scary. In fact, I think he might even die. But, this should be fine. Yeah, so... It would have been really nice if Pent didn't get hit by that, but... Okay. Then... Hector will actually just rescue him. And then you will... You have a lovely conversation right here, but it's not quite worth it. Staff, mend, heal up Pent. Yeah, so... The main reason that Jafar and or Legault is better than, like, Guy or Carol being monolocked sword users that rely on crits, they can just instantly kill you with a crit. Which is a really big boon. Like, it's pretty fucking great that they can do that. And all morphs have no luck. Which is very significant. Alright, uh, Geats, get Canis out of there. And then... Yeah, I, the problem is I have no idea, like, what door opens next. Or if I'm even going to have to do an instant reset. Alright. There we go. I do not have to do an instant reset. That's fine. Look, ult will do fine. The next door that opens is the long-range spell door, right? Baltine, Physic, Luce, Gempence. Alright. Hmm. I guess the logical thing to do would be to just dance for Farina, who can just fly over there. So I think that's what I'm going to do here. I'm going to hope that Legault can get the Silencer crit, but regardless... Yeah, you should be fine. Yep. Yeah, you're super fine. So, yeah, fun fact that, like, some of the legendary weapons just don't have a host. Like, Kenneth from that one chapter. But, yeah, they never had a powerful dark magic user. Except, I believe they did in the, uh, 18X. X. Yeah, I couldn't get that because I didn't do Lin mode. But you actually do find a druid there. So they could have used him. Alright. What well, do you have a longbow? Yeah, so. Uh, I have no idea what door opens next. It, it could be Ursula's door. I'm not entirely sure. But. Yeah. Actually. I can get rid of this guy. With Pent. Who is going to get hit again. God damn it. But that's not a big deal. Not a big deal at all. Then I can have... You get rescued. Um... I'm gonna have to... Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, do you not have a longbow? Oh, you don't. 
That's not good. Oh, you actually can rescue Keats, can you? Yeah, okay, so... This is still capable of working out. Priscilla will finish him off. I meant to use Geats there. I literally had a detailed explanation of why Geats was the correct decision, and then I just didn't. And then I just didn't. I see. Oh, this should still be fine. Take. Drop. And then... Take. Drop. And then heal him up. So, so far so good. Um, this chapter is one of those dumb ones where, like, you might want to just reset to figure out who shows up where. But once you do... Yeah... I'm going to have Farina fall back and kind of let them come to me. Oh, he's just going to go after Legault again. Makes sense. Yeah. God. Ultimate Dark Magic looks so cool. I think Naglfar looks better, but that might just be my bias talking. Alright. There is Brendan. And then just a warrior. Who has no real lore reason to be there. Uh, let's just hope here that Legault is... Well, well wait a minute. Yeah, Legault should be able to finish off Uhai here. Mm-hmm, please. Yeah, okay. Uh, I have no one that can use the Rain Flitch, but his Killer Ledge just broke, so... Yeah, he can... he can show up. Alright, Farina's gonna move over to here. Uh... Yeah. Let me just... Right, someone that can double him would be you, so let's move Lin down. Have Canis mend Farina, and I'm probably gonna have to have Priscilla and Pent join in on that. But that's fine. Alright. Mend you up. Staff, mend for Farina. And we are looking good. We are looking very kosher. Yeah, you're gonna... Mm-hmm. And that is fine. Um... Yeah, I want to do this... Because I want to trigger a really cool boss conversation between Legault and, uh... Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That drops. Yeah, he's fine. A really cool boss conversation between Brendan and Legault. It's one of my favorites for Legault's character. But it's just... It requires using... Legault at this point. Yeah, so... Drop. Nils, play for him. Should probably heal him. Uh, Nils is capped level. Damn it, I was really hoping for the strength point. Okay. Staff, mend for Legault. And that's going on up. Oh, okay. And staff weapon rank increased. A little late for that, but mm, it's fine. Then Legault. This one's really good. I like this one. Commander, I really didn't want to see you like this. All I can give you is one last act of rebellion. I fucking love that line. Alright, so we got a regular crit. Not the best. Yeah, this entire chapter is just Legault's clinical depression. Uh, okay, so what do you guys have? You have the Rex Hosta, which I really want. Um, I guess send my bulkiest boy to come greet you. 
And that's for you. Yep. Oh, Athos. Well, wouldn't be anything else if I didn't forget to do that for the last character in the game. Alright, so he is like almost dead. I do want to be careful here because I could aggro them into coming on down. Uh, Geats? Almost. Well, yeah, no, 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 no. Yeah, that would do it. But I don't want to do it like that. I don't think I have a choice, because... Well, no. Actually, I do. I totally do. I'll fire him. He is not quite dead. However, Geats will... They all have the same hit chance. Silver bow him to death? Okay. Uh. You, you, you think? <laughs> uh. Now that was, that was worth an attempt. Well. That's how this is gonna go. And he is dead. She's gonna level up, which probably, she still has some room to grow, so it might actually be really nice and helpful. Okay, she's been a little screwed on the strength lately, but considering that she's two points away from capping, really not that big a deal. Alright, Harkin. Yep. And he's just instantly killing him. Good old Harkin. Alright. So, he's dead. Lynn and Ellawood can just vibe, I guess. Yeah, this... Yeah, Darren is not at all threatening to me. In fact, I wonder if the Wolf Bale is... Oh, that's right, it's a unique animation if he uses the R mods. That's nice. Alright. Mm-hmm, not a problem. So... The next one that opens is that one down there, which is kind of bad. Excalibur is a little scary. But that guy just has a rune sword. Athos probably... Uh, with four blaze has a... Is going to do a pretty penny to her. What about you with a silver bow? Also capable of doing a pretty penny. Luna? I can finish him off with that, but, oops, hmm. Well, what about you? Hmm. Uh, oh god, that means the brothers are up there. I think I might actually do more damage to him with the Wolf Bale. The, the Wolf Bale! How damage is the legendary Armods? Wow. What a legendary weapon. <laughs> Good lord. Alright. Alternately, I could just not... Now. Athos. Four blaze. Get a crit to start us off. I think that's a crit. That certainly was a crit. Goodbye, Ursula Ghoul. Give that Excalibur to Athos. Uh, yeah, you're gonna probably double him for, like, no damage at all. So. Jafar. Killing Edge. Actually. Thor's Ire. And then Killing Edge. Dak, Killing Edge. Alright, please don't crit. Alright, he doesn't. Alright, now can you get... There it is, Silencer. I never realized just how useful that really is. Okay. Got the loose. There's not... I guess a lockpick technically is worth less. 
Um, if I move up here with you, yeah, I just outright kill. So Priscilla will fortify with a lot of magic. Okay, we're actually getting through this pretty well, actually. Like, hot damn. Though, if something tells me, I'm gonna regret saying that. Alright, Farina. Just kill him. Yep, Guess Pensed is a really cool name for a tome. Yeah, it's not as cool as Apocalypse or uh, Naglfar or. I think it's the least impressive of the S-ranked Dark Magic tomes, but it still looks cool. Like, Dark Magic is, uh, required to look. Yeah, just drop that. This is... I don't know why I held on to that. I had no need, reason to. But, yeah. Ellawood. Make sure the, uh, Arola is what he has equipped for that bastard. And then... Canis and Geats, I guess. And then Lin. Enemy phase. Ooh! Get started on. And we'll have the Rex Hosta for Farina soon. Which is gonna be very nice. Yup. Imagine being this guy. Yeah, so that's his normal animation. <sighs> that, honestly, Aurola is really cool. Oriola? Alright. Okay. Yep, and there they are. He has the Regal Blade. So basically... Yeah, this isn't... This is... Well, it's gonna be cool. Alright. Thor's ire, raise the Galt's crit. Cheese lethality to beat this game. I don't care. I've suffered through enough. Iron rune. Yep. Then the wolf bale will finish the job. So goodbye, Darren. And give that Rex Hasta over to Farina. Right? I believe. 13. Good level up. Speed and defense. There we go. Boom. Get the Rex Hosta. Get rid of that iron sword for it. Uh, Athos can finish off this punk. With the crit now, that's useless. Not even the mighty Arch Sage of Godhood is immune to the unnecessary crit. <sighs> we are getting there. We're nearing the end of one of the what is considered one of the greatest challenges in all of Fire Emblem. At least by yeah. Linus really gets the short end of the stick with his ghoul. Like, he gets a brave sword and a tomahawk. That's his big grand finale. I mean, I get that Brendan Reed was built up as a really strong leader of the Black Fang, but it could have been cooler. Yep. Even as a monster, you are a handsome one, Lloyd. But you know what's something? I, I can't let this continue. Alright, so... Yep. Yeah, so Hector is gonna nearly be able to just two-bang this guy. He could get a crit, which would be nice. Yeah, no dice. Okay. So... Yeah, I have to finish them all off before, uh, before I can progress. So, Lin. And then you can get another play of Thor's Ire. But this one is for... I don't remember if you need to do damage to kill with Silencer. I don't believe that you do... But, okay, well, mm, hang on, view, with our mods, he's gonna do a pretty penny of damage, so I'm just gonna 
I'm just gonna tomahawk to kill this guy. The tomahawk looks so tiny compared to the other axes he can use. Okay. Uh, Ganus with Luna. We'll see how he does. Alright, so he isn't gonna crit. He's not gonna do damage. Alright, Lloyd is being a cheeky dick. Uh, just like before. Yeah, we're gonna have to... Hmm. Let's see how this goes. Oh, we meet again. This stinks. He's just going through therapy. And like... I'm not... Oh, is this gonna kill? Yup. Okay, so Silencer does not need to do damage to kill. His skin turns back. I... Do they die as themselves? I... I never noticed that. Wait a minute. Do... Do the morphs all die as themselves? Alright, 19 damage. Okay, I, I... I really probably need that to hit. Yeah. Do... Do the morphs die as themselves? Hang on. I need to... I need to take a look at this. Does Lloyd's color return to him? I never noticed that. Holy shit. Nurgle does have their souls or something. He... Oh, you're a fucking bastard man, Nurgle. Okay. If I remember correctly, you have Berserk. Which looks super annoying, and it is super annoying, but that is why I have fucking Restore. I did not come unprepared for your bullshit. Alright. Now I also remember that I want to move up. But let me just... I am going to fortify. Okay. Okay. Holy shit, that adds a whole new layer of depression. Alright. But. Okay. Let's have him chill there. I don't think Nurgle moves. But he might. And that would kind of suck if he did. Alright. So he's gonna berserk Canis. Oh. Well, there goes all my luck for the rest of the run. Alright. We start move Legault up. We then play for Legault. Alright. Legault doesn't need that much more move to get to Nurgle. I'm pretty sure he doesn't move. I'm pretty sure he does not move. Uh. Yeah. So, Harkin's gonna... Yeah, Harkin's gonna make quick work of this guy. As he do. Uh, it's gonna look scary. But, you know, in control the entire time. Alright, 91 XP. That's kinda cool. Okay. Canis is going to mend Harkin. And as is Priscilla. It would be really unfortunate if Nurgle moved, but I'm like 900% certain that he does not. Like, 50... Like, unless Canis got doubled by him. Which he wouldn't. So, let's... How far off is the goal? 1, 2, 3. So, 1, 2, 3. Right there. And then... We have Pent, Staff. Does he not have a heal at all? Oh, no. That's because he's trying to heal someone who is at full health. Yeah. So, here goes. Does Nurgle have luck? I should have checked that. He has a little luck, so it's going to be a little harder to kill him. But, trade, give him the Rex Hosta. 
wait, trade, give him, or make that little trade there. And then just bring you up. Uh, we're going to rescue Athos. Take, drop him. Lin, I guess. Like, what do you two have? Do you have, like, staves? You just have Nosferatu. Alright. Who gives a fuck? Alright, here we go. Collide with Nurgle time. Oh, let's let the generals move first. Alright. So they're gonna he's gonna try to berserk Canis again. Wow! Canis really does not give a shit about you. Alright. So let's play. Can I play this safer? Yeah, I can definitely play this safer. And then you can move up with yeah, yeah, I can play this safer, and I should play this safer. Play Fila's Might for Farina. And then she's gonna move up here with the Rex Hasta. God. I love, um, Shaman in the Dark. Such a bop. And this is the real best Dark Magic to- What the fuck? Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, Legault. Just, just to humor me. Because when I move up with Athos, you're dead. So, just to humor me, let's see how this goes. Okay. God, that looks so cool. I'm not even mad that that hit. Okay, yeah. That's just wanted to humor me. Alright. I can get Harkin to level up before... Yeah, I can get Harkin to level up before the end here. Yeah. So that'll be good. Awful shame I didn't realize I was overusing his axe rank so I couldn't get him to use the regal sword. But... Health and speed. Yep. What do you have now, buddy? Yeah, you're not close enough. Not even close to close enough. Is he yeah, Hector, I can get one more level up as well. So, hopefully it'll be a good one, because we are about to enter the final, final showdown. Dead. And level up. Something good. Maybe some, like, bulk, probably. Strength, skill, and defense. That. Hector isn't too bad in the end. Hmm. Alright. So, here goes. Athos. Finish him off. Yep. Good, no, good little scene for Athos. Yep. I really like Athos. He's, um... He's probably my favorite of the Gateaus. But that archetype has kind of become uncommon. Well, actually, has it? Awakening didn't have one. Fates didn't have one. Three Houses doesn't have one. Yeah, that's right. None of them had one. The last Gateau was Lahran, I think. Yeah. Lahran was the last one. You had Gateau himself. And then you had... I guess, does Carol count as one? I guess he does. Uh, plot stuff. Blah, blah, blah. I don't want to skip this because I'm afraid I'll skip the final battle quotes, which I don't want to skip. There we go. Then Bryman comes back and kind of plot devices this. I really hate this scene, truth be told. Like, Ninian should have stayed dead. There was no reason to bring her back to life. Like, Ellawood had great character development for it, and you just throw it all away. Like, just have Nurgle bring back one dragon. Like, one dragon already killed, um, Ephidel. You know one dragon's fucking powerful. So you don't 
need to bring back three. You already showed how powerful a dragon is. So, like... You could have killed, kept me and dead, had one dragon emerge, and then we fight that dragon. That would have been fine. Would have been better. Alright. Now we just have to kill a dragon. Alright, I accidentally skipped. Fine. Alright, you have sleep, purge, purge, bolting. I think they exist just to, like not let you cheese this so let's cheese this yep those that can actually fight the dragon come fight the dragon so this shouldn't be too hard actually my units are adequately leveled yep yeah, so... Uh, Canis, trade over the most powerful spell to the old man here. Because as you can see, when he does that, he only has 20. But Luna, he even has a chance to crit. I'm not even going to try. I know for a fact that, um... <laughs> Athos will not be able to... I'm not going to try to bank on a crit. I'm just going to bank on 40 goddamn damage. And I do like that the dragon is programmed to be able to bring Athos to 1 HP, but not quite kill him. Yeah, so that's like... That hurts. So, okay. Geats won't... Yeah, Geats cannot. However, with the Rex Hosta, every little bit helps. Which is 100% fine by me. Yep, at this point all I have to do is survive one turn of combat. Like, if I can do that, this chapter is one. Can the dragon move? Okay, so it can. Let's, uh... Alright, so he gets weighed down by the Durandal. But simply having Elowood there with a silver sword is enough of a detractor. So, we're gonna... Make sure that I don't leave Pent in that guy's range. Yeah. Um, Nilus is in range, but that shouldn't be a problem. Okay. We're just gonna... Yeah, wait. Then, um... Get a little scared, but not too much. Just make sure that I don't let him... Okay. We are going to staff, fortify everyone. Mm-hmm. And as long as that brings people close enough to not dead... Alright. We'll see how everyone looks. Okay, eighth, we're gonna have to do it again, but with Pent. Um... Okay. What is his speed? 16, 17. Alright, with 20 defense, he does 39 damage. So, he has the same amount of HP. Canis will die if he is left there. So, we're going to have to make sure he's not weighed down by what he's holding. 6, not weighed down. Alright. Yeah. Rescue. Take. Drop. Staff. Trade for the Fortify, right? That's what I want to do. Yeah. Trade. Fortify for... Uh... A 
silence, and then fortify. And then Lin is actually probably 100% capable of just instantaneously dying if she gets hit by bolting. I'm going to have to check that. Because... Fairly sure, certain that can happen. Right? Let me see. 27 and 8. 31. Okay, so she actually won't die. Well, 100% definitely die to the dragon... But won't die. Nils, twelve defense. Uh, yeah, twelve defense, thirty nine damage. Oh, well, actually, why do I feel like that's not quite okay? So if eight those took thirty nine, it pierces. I think maybe I don't. Let's see, what's his avoid? 76. No, he'll get hit. Alright, we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to rescue him. Yeah, he can't be hit by those guys. Cannot be hit. And then... Let's... Oh, God. Right, hang on. Yeah. Item... Equip the, the Manic T, take, drop. Here we go. Oh, Anthos has a chance to just be the MVP here if he crits with this Luna. I don't know why the dragon wants to attack Athos. And he crits! That is how you end a fucking Let's Play, baby. Get fucking bent. Look at him go. Holy cow. I have no idea what my end rank will be, but holy shit. That's the way to end it. That's how you do it, folks. Fuck this plot. It's, it's a great plot sometimes, but fuck it. It's not why we're here. Blah, blah, blah. Sad music. Goodbye. There goes one amazing character. And then the sun's coming through. We're all alright. We got the friendship ending. I didn't marry Hector or Ellawood off to anyone. They are bros. One year later. Yep. So. Plot. Plot. Good boy, he will have a happy ending definitely, and definitely will is be a okay in 20 years. Staff. All rights earned by intelligent systems. Thank you so much for making this wonderful game. All right. Yeah, I was. Yeah, fucking the Kashuna chapters. I was slow on. But I was fairly like I wasn't like LT scene or every or anything. But I wasn't going too slow. Alright, we're just going through epilogues. I didn't pair anyone off, so like I mainly just want to see my end rank, but I don't know if pressing start skips it. I can't skip it, actually. Oh I apparently I can. Oh, I might have just skipped. Oh, no. Hang on. Uh. Oh, God. Yep. Hang on. Can I see my end rank? Extras. Uh. Battle history, I guess. Uh, right. This was a ROM, by the way. Um. Yeah, so that's some glitchy shit. I'm not going to be able to see my end rank unless I sit through the entire epilogue. Which, I don't feel like doing. So, uh... Sorry. I got an A. I aced it. Five stars on everything. 
for sure that is definitely what happened. <clears throat> so, I guess, thank you all so much. This has been a very fun time. Really made me appreciate Fire Emblem 7's gameplay more. I've always played Fire Emblem for the story more than the characters, or more than the gameplay. But, this was fun. There were some parts that made me want to pull my hair out, but it was fun. Uh, I plan to start Vesteria Saga next, so I sincerely hope you'll stick around with me for that. And uh, thank you so much for this month and some change. And may the new year for you be absolutely wonderful. I'm rooting for you. Good. Have a great day.